Hello, my beautiful people. Today we're going to do a quick and really easy but really beautiful project. Um, I'm going to use this glass piece from the Dollar Tree, but you can use anything you want. If you want to use a wine bottle to do this project or um, just something you already have around the house, it does not matter um, at all. You could do this on any piece that you like. I am going to also use these I got these from the Dollar Tree and um, I got them around 4th of July but I didn't end up using them I don't want to waste them and they do come in the red and blue but that doesn't matter it doesn't matter what color they come in because I'm gonna spray paint over it I am gonna use some painters tape and some black spray paint this is a flat uh, black paint and primer. I hope you all can see that. And when I get done, I'm either going to spray it with this Rust-Oleum Crystal Clear Enamel to protect it, or if you don't have that, don't worry about it. Put some Mod Podge on it and, and it's fine. I'm going to use that because it's quicker for me. So let's get started. For those of you who've watched my other videos in the past and um, you've asked about this tool down in the comments that I use, this pick me up tool, I'll leave a link for it below. Um, if you all don't use these particular um, pearls, or yeah, they're pearls, that I got from the Dollar Tree and you just find loose pearls somewhere because these are sometimes hard to find at the Dollar Tree and these already have a little adhesive on it. They come on a row like this, so I'm gonna have to take them off and put them on individually. But if you're using some loose pearls or loose stones to do this project, then you're gonna wanna use this pick-me-up tool. It'll keep you from getting glue on your hands and I'll show you how it works. Um, I use it a lot and people ask me questions about it all the time. So it has like a little putty on the end of it and I put a stone right here on the top of this and all I do is pick it up with the little putty and I put it on top of the glue. So if you all can't find these um, pearls that I'm using and you end up using some loose pearls, this tool comes in handy. It also has a little thing on the end for moving it around into the glue so you still don't get anything on your hands. So, for this project, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna decide something first. Um, I need to put some tape around here, and can y'all see that? Let me move this camera down just a little bit. There you go. So, I want the top of it to have um, black, and I want the bottom to have the black, but I don't want it in the middle. And I'm thinking I might put some flowers in the top of this when I'm done. So all I'm gonna do is tape off what I don't want to get spray painted so that it can remain clear. And y'all that watch me all the time know I'm not a perfectionist, so I don't try to be. I just try to enjoy what I'm doing, enjoy my life. <laughs> so I'm eyeballing it today, and it's turning out pretty good. But for those of you who are not comfortable with this, you can get some water and put it in here, get it to where you want it, and then sit it flat, and you can put the tape around it, and that'll help you out there. So I am going to put... No, I think that's enough. I think we're good. Now what I'm going to do is, this already has some adhesive on it, so I'm just going to start putting these on here. And I feel like since I'm going to be spray painting over it, the spray paint is going to help hold it also. I was going to use my hot glue gun, but I'm not going to do it. Um, I'm losing light. <laughs> I'm tired today. And uh, it's the end of the day. I had a lot of stuff to do today, so I am losing light, and I don't really, I don't think it's gonna matter if I use the hot glue gun or not. So I'm gonna go ahead and just place these sporadically on here. Um, 
as you can see that's all I'm doing and oh yeah by the way while I'm just rambling here I because I'm tired I went and I put some heels on because that just always does it for me anytime I'm tired I just throw a pair of heels on what do y'all do when you're tired but you still got some stuff to do <laughs> I'm curious to know because that's my that's my um, fix all for everything heels and clutches so y'all always hear me talking about that but I'm gonna go ahead and continue putting these on sporadically I'm gonna come back and show you what it looks like when I have more on there okay y'all I put the little pearls on the top half and the bottom half and I did for a couple of these I had to use the hot glue gun because sometimes the little adhesive strip uh, wasn't cooperating with me so you may want some type of glue you know beside you just in case you need it and now I am going to take this out and spray paint it so I'm gonna spray it all black and then it'll probably be um, tomorrow when I have better lighting that I'll take pictures of it but I'm gonna take you out with me and we are gonna get this thing done so let's do it so I'm gonna turn it upside down so that none of the spray paint gets on the inside of it and you're just gonna give it a light coat of spray because <laughs> you're gonna have to come back and give it another coat and yes this is gonna be all kinds of good I can already tell so all I'm gonna do is spray this let it dry give it another coat and then seal it and you can already tell that this is gonna be really pretty and um, yeah it's gonna be pretty and I might add some white roses to the top of this just to really set it off I'm really into black and white right now so I'll be back okay so earlier I may have mentioned that you could um, stick these on because they have some adhesive on them but no you're gonna need to glue them mine didn't work out well by just sticking them on I had to go back and glue them so go ahead and use your hot glue gun um, or some of the E6000 and stick them on and by the way y'all I'm sorry I had my on my wisdom teeth pulled today so I hope that y'all can hear me <laughs> and I hope I don't sound too funny um, tomorrow if I'm feeling better I'll do another project if not I'll just be off tomorrow but this is how it looks when it's all complete and I'm gonna show it to you in a grouping I have some other um, other pieces that I did with black and I think that they'll go good with this one so I'm going to show you them all together and I hope you've liked it if you like this piece and you like this video go ahead and give it a thumbs up and let me know down below in the comments that's the only way I know if I need to keep making videos or not is if you tell me also go ahead and subscribe today and um, let me show you the completed project all together here is the completed project I just put some roses in the top of it I just took a styrofoam ball from the Dollar Tree and um, added some roses to the top of it they are also from the Dollar Tree and just sat it on top you do not have to use that and I wanted to show you these other pieces that I think would go good with it these I used glitter and spray paint and they're really some of my favorite favorite pieces I will leave a link below in the description box to show you how I made these two. Oops, I got all kinds of glue and stuff on my hands. So, I thank you so much for joining me today. I appreciate you all, and I hope to see you again. Let me know what you think about these pieces, and um, I like the way this one turned out. I really do, but I think my all-time favorite is still these ones in the back with the glitter. They, they were really simple also, so anyways thank you so much for watching and you can do these in any color and um that fits the needs of whatever type of party you're having i hope you've enjoyed it enjoy the rest of your day and i will see you next time bye bye beautiful people